It was a time when a young black boy his age could be hung from a tree. Emmett Till in Money, Mississippi in 1955, whose admitted killers went free. It was a time when Muhammad's friends, men that he admired, like Brother Malcolm, Dr. King, were gunned down and Nelson Mandela imprisoned for what they believed in. For his part, Muhammad faced federal prosecution. He was stripped of his title and his license to box, and he was sentenced to prison. But he would not be intimidated so as to abandon his principles and his values. <laughs> Muhammad wants young people of every background to see his life as proof that adversity can make you stronger. It cannot rob you of the power to dream and to reach your dreams. Muhammad may have challenged his government, but he never ran from it or from America. He loved this country, and he understood the hard choices that are born of freedom. I think he saw a nation's soul measured by the soul of its people. For his part, he saw the good soul in everyone. And if you were one of the lucky ones to have met him, you know what I meant. He awoke every morning thinking about his own salvation, and he would often say, I just want to get to heaven, and I've got to do a lot of good deeds to get there. And I think Muhammad's hope is that his life provides some guidance on how we might achieve for all people what we aspire for ourselves and our families.